color we went and these sides and there's a lot of oddly colored gorgeous animals out there but today we're talking about pigeons rainbow pigeons this bird might seem like the gloomiest most plain species there is but actually no it's the urbanized common pigeon we see today that are boring in color there are many other species of pigeon that are gorgeous <laughs> Welcome to IBTSO, and today we're talking about rainbow pigeons. The possibility of mythical creatures being real is amazing, but first off, we have to list out some species that actually resemble a rainbow pigeon. First off, the pink neck green pigeon. This little guy lives in moist southeast Asian tropical forests. Only males have the rich rainbow color palette, while females are usually of a dark green color. They range from 25 to 32 centimeters in height. It is not endangered and is well protected in its natural habitat. The Victoria Crown Pigeon, who's named after Queen Victoria and her crown, is a blue gray feller also native to New Guinea and is considered one of the three purdy birds native to the region. These orange-legged, orange-pupiled, orange-wingtip, whoop-whoop hollered mother cluckers roam the jungle forest scavenging for fallen fruit. But don't you try to sneak up on one, because it will just fly straight up into a tree and wait for you to leave. Unfortunately, there are less and less of these bad boys because of logging and deforestation. Sad face. The Nicobar pigeon resides in coastal areas of the Nicobar Islands in India and is the closest living relative of the extinct dodo bird. Okay, evolution can go a long way, but with its appearance, I kind of doubt that the Nicobar pigeon would be the closest living relative of this extinct bird. As for its appearance, it is a very big pigeon, measuring 40 centimeters in height, and females are actually not that different in color from males, they're just smaller and a bit duller. This species is not becoming endangered due to habitat loss, but rather they're being hunted down for food and for their precious gizzard stones to be used as jewelry. Thank you all so much for watching, and bye!